mine because of brain cancer. I lost a, a lot of weight oh. and was diagnosed with diabetes. Oh, is that their new thing? You don't have cancer, you have diabetes. Oh my god, just that, well they have liabetes. Yeah, liabetes. Get out of here. There's multiple lumps, Kayla, that I have all over my breasts. Big open sores all around it. So if that's what the doctors are telling me, you probably have cancer. Breast cancer, and uh, what am I supposed to do? Be like, okay, I don't have it? I can't even think about it, but I know, like, if it does come up positive, which I'm thinking it will because of this weight loss, okay? That's the scary thing, because I have not been really trying to lose weight at all. Oh my god. At all. That is the best sandwich I ever had. Weapon lock. We got that. Sawed off shotgun car. And I know I'm exhibiting all the fucking symptoms of cancer. I know I am. Because I have a medical background. You know, I've, I've seen people. My mom and dad both had cancer. The question is, where the fuck is it? That's the question. Where is it? So... I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have my gynecological exam because he's thinking the symptoms are related to like cervical or uteral cancer, which is not the worst cancer. It's very curable. Um, he's also said possibly breast cancer. And then there's another one. My brain is not working. I apologize. Maybe I do have brain cancer as well. That'll be funny. <laughs> I slowly lose my mind because of brain cancer. That 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 would be that would be like, yep, Shannon, that that would happen with your fucking life. Smears. <sighs> Don't you hate getting pap smears? And you know what? It would be appropriate for me to have like uterine cancer cancer it would it would it would be a, a, appropriate for me to get that because Amberlyn Reed got it and Chantal got it and since I'm part of the unholy trinity as some people like to say that's so blasphemous by the way maddening to just realize like huh your chances of death have gone up significantly lately congratulations yay you most likely have cancer shannon congratulations yay but maybe it's diabetes i doubt it though i haven't had my biopsy yet do, 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 do they listen to the words that come out of my mouth? I don't think so. I don't think so. I said at this point right now, it should be going fast. It should go fast after this point. Because they already got the blood tests. They, they already have the visuals of it. They just need to go inside it to see. I'm sorry. Let's hope if I have cancer, it's not metastatic. Yeah, that's, that's, yeah, that's everything. Yeah, let's just hope that it's contained and it can be easily removed. Exactly, that's what I'm praying for. Is the case. But see, they're gonna have to figure out where it's at. Yeah. You're right about that one. And that could involve exploratory surgery even. Sure, of course. I understand. Doctor, well, when you lose 40 pounds in two months, that's gonna scare any doctor. True. So 
Oh, I'm most likely having cancer. Yay. Yay me. Watch Drag have fucking videos called The Cancer Saga because he's a piece of shit. When I was 23 after I had my first son, um, I ended up with really bad, like, lung infection and they found a bunch of polyps in my lungs and they said you really need to get this checked out again and I never did. Watch it. I guarantee. What a psycho. I, That's I much mean, of a I piece of shit he is. Yeah. And here, here he is. I'm a cancer doctor. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah. I wouldn't want you to fucking care for me at all. I don't give a fuck. I love this guy. Mm-hmm. I played through this whole he thing. You, you should beat it. He, it's proof. He doesn't cure cancer. He causes cancer. He's a cancer causer. Yeah, he probably did cause all the stress he's put me under. He probably did cause this. Let's I just mean, be honest. I would say probably. And maybe that's what he's testing to see if stress causes it. Well, oh, he's a researcher giving people cancer deliberately. Wow, isn't that nice? Hey guys, what's up? Rev here. Um, I just want to give you a little um, Shani update because she's been pretty silent everywhere. Um, I think the main thing she's dealing with right now is psych psychologically um, because we had a pushback that second ultrasound for you know reasons that you don't need to worry about. Um, she's still dealing with the stress of having to go and, and get the ultrasound uh, and some kind of other mammogram they, they said it was it's it's like I, I don't know if it's more advanced I don't I don't know if it's a different I maybe they can get different angles and stuff like that but it's a she's got to do another mammogram too so that I think that's been really weighing on her because it as long as that it's like you know the sword of Damocles is over your head and it's like uh, you don't know what's going to happen so that's extremely stressful stuff and and I know fake cancer fake cancer that's what's gonna I don't care what you say like she's going through real stuff and they are checking her out for it okay I mean this is it's just really dumb to me these things like the attorney general investigation and stuff it's so out of this world insane it's like they try to make her Trump you know like the absolute worst human being on the planet and, and let's indict her for this and that and this and that and it's it's insane and if you think that stuff doesn't mess with your mental state when you've been on the internet for forever it does it it, it beats you down psychologically um to a point where you don't even want to talk anymore and that's i think that's really where she's at because it's it's one thing to go through a health crisis it's bad enough it's bad enough as you as a singular human being that's going through these very scary tests and waiting periods and then more tests and then waiting periods it's extremely stressful and then you have these people that insist on dogpiling and, and going fake 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 this is fake that's fake i i don't think you understand unless you went through it you're not going to understand how infuriating it's 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 it makes you so angry for the people that are around the person but for the person that's going through it it's sadness it's 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 this feeling of nobody cares about me and as a matter of fact they want me to die that, that's the vibes that you're putting on someone when you're doing this fake cancer, fake cancer bullshit, okay? She is literally walking through a storm pretty much alone. I'm, I can be there, but it, she still has to go through it. So always pray. Um, if you're of the persuasion to pray, pray. If you're of the persuasion to give good vibes, please do. That's, you know, new age stuff. You give your good vibes, whatever. It's cool. Um, but ma material financial need is always there too. Um, so if you want to, if you can, my PayPal is at RevDude, R-E-V-D-U-D-E. -E, at RevDude is my PayPal if you can help me out. Um, it's just like constant need for something. It's, it's, it's money. I just, I hate money so much. I really hate money. Um, but really, prayers, if you just send oh, us... I know, okay? This is what I know. This is radiology only. This is my doctor. This is radiology only. Um, from the mammogram and the ultrasound. Um, I do have a mass, um, 
probably the size of like chewed up bubble gum in my right breast. I don't know anything about my left breast. I haven't talked to my doctor about it, but my right breast, this is what I know from today. Okay. I have a lump in my right breast um, and they're going to be monitoring it and I'm scheduled to go back to get another mammogram in six, six months um, to monitor the size and the growth and how it is because of the position. They're not quite sure. Uh, so if that's what the doctors are telling me, you probably have cancer breast cancer and uh, what am I supposed to do be like okay I don't have it but they're gonna be monitoring that in six months to see if it's any growth there I don't like I said I don't know anything about the left breast I haven't talked to my doctor you don't know what's gonna happen so that's extremely stressful stuff and and I know oh, fake cancer fake cancer that's what's gonna I don't care what you say like she's going through real stuff and they are checking her out for it okay I mean this is it's just really dumb to me, these, but material, financial need is always there, too. Um, so if you want to, if you can, my PayPal is at RevDude, R-E-V-D-U-D-E, at RevDude is my PayPal, if you can help me out.